it's Karen here. The other day I was showing three cards honoring children's books, and this was Corduroy with the missing button. But I know I've had some questions about how I did the kind of corduroy look. It's just very soft and worn, his overalls. So a couple things I want to show you here. I just took a piece of scrap paper, cardstock, just all the little leftovers, scrunch it up really good. You can also spritz it with a little water, which makes it a little easier to bend. If I were doing a bunch of them, I would be doing that, but this will be good enough for now. And once I have this all kind of mashed up, when I open it up, I have torn the fibers. Let's see if this will work quickly enough. Oh, here we go. Okay. So now you will see I have torn the fibers here. So I can pull these apart just like this. And I'm going to get this really soft. Um, makes great little baby blankets. If you have a stamp of a baby and you want to wrap it in a little blanket. Okay, so here's my thing. And then the other part of this is, this is really dating me, but when I was young, we used to take all of the catalogs that came in the mail. It was a big deal back then. And I would cut out the, you know, some of the models and then make my own clothes. Kind of homemade version of paper dolls. That's exactly what I'm doing here. I'm going to just figure out where that goes make lines where the shorts are going to go, and then even a thing for the middle. And then, of course, I'm going to take a trusty scissors. Oh, good, I do have one here. My uh, table gets a little cluttered on a video day, but I'm going to go through like this and trim, trim this. Okay, here's where that can go. So if you can see what I'm doing, I am just kind of following through here. I put these on. And I'll make a little opening there. And I don't want my little pen mark here. You know, I'd, I'd do this a little more carefully if I weren't trying to hurry for the video. So I'm going to put that on. Look how fun that is. And then I can just make any little changes that I want. I can probably want this to come down a little further. And then I want one of these little flaps to just fold on over because he's missing his button. So there, quick idea. So now you can dress your uh, bears in anything you would like to. So thanks for watching. Karen Titus, Stamping on the Back Porch.